Hey folks, Co Simmons here. And sometimes you gotta roll with the punches, right? Looking at what's going on with the Mountain West Conference and of course the Conference USA, and let's extend the Sun Belt. It's making you realize something's about to hit the FCS ranks. And we gotta ask ourselves, what, if anything, will that be? Well, let's play dominoes real quick. Mountain West just hit up, bringing in UTEP, which means Conference USA loses one team. Now, rumor was, hey, maybe they're going to bring up Texas State or Charleston State. Well, that's where the thing gets if. Remember, Conference USA already wanted to bring in a team before this all happened. But now, let's play devil's advocate here. Let's say they bring in Texas State University from the Sun Belt to go join UTEP in the Mountain West Conference. Well, the game of musical chairs, one has to replace the other. And for the Sun Belt, it's very simple. You go grab those profitable team from the Conference USA. So we know right now, San Francisco State's on the historic run of being 4-1, and one, but you don't get them. You don't want Kennesaw, you don't want Middle Tennessee State. You want Liberty from Virginia. Liberty in Virginia for the Sun Belt solidifies them. It makes them whole. So, now that that happens, unless you wanted to go ahead and maintain your regional games, then you go get Sam Houston State. But, but besides all that, we don't care about all that. Conference USA will have holes to fill. If Liberty goes to the Sun Belt, they have two holes to fill. They already got in a SE Mo coming in. They can't really bring nobody else in there that's not already going. Which means, yeah, there's the rumors of Tarleton State. There's still only one team. If they lost two schools, there'll be two more available over. Well, Conference USA being technically a Southern Conference, it's really only four schools left. I hate to say it, people. You have the one with the most, let's call it geographical advantage being Prairie View, close to Houston. The one with the most financial backing being Texas, uh, Tennessee State. The one that brags different being FAMU was the defending HBCU champion and school that tried to go FBS once before. They know the pains and hardships. Then you have the megaphone, Jackson State. What other school we better to join your conference? And if they start winning, if they start winning to be one of the top teams in your conference to show you or to advertise for you. See, all this stuff trickles down, people. How did the Mountain West pull up UTEP? If they also pull up Texas State and then somebody pulls up Liberty, there are two holes that must be filled from the South. What do you think? It's Coach Simmons. Man, it's getting interesting.